The momentum of public support continues to grow in the wrongful conviction case of Ronnie Long. Long has spent 44 years in prison, and while we wait on a ruling by the Court of Appeals, lawmakers, faith leaders, and regular folk are standing in support. As the Fourth Circuit Court of Appeals ponders over a mountain of evidence that shows police withheld that evidence and manipulated the investigation, people are also hoping Governor Cooper will commute Ronnie Long's sentence. Faith leaders from across the state have written the governor asking for that to happen. More than a dozen legislators have done the same thing. I'm really excited and happy. It's uh, very encouraging. Um, you know, to have finally have all this support for Ronnie. Long has been in prison 44 years. His rape conviction by an all white jury led to massive protests outside the Cabarrus County Courthouse. People believe then that he was innocent, and today the Duke Wrongful Convictions Clinic says they were right. Just part of the appeal includes the fact that none of the fingerprints nor hair samples at the scene matched Long. I think people are finally starting to believe that, oh, we're not just saying that you know, to say he's innocent. No, these are actually facts that happened and have been proven. Long's wife, Ashley, says that's partly due to other cases involving police that have gotten recent national attention. She is grateful for the letters to the governor and a change.org petition with nearly 35,000 signatures, but would like to see even more people get on board. I would like to see, you know, a lot higher numbers a lot quicker because I feel like, you know, he needs that, he needs like that amount of public outrage and pressure to really get him out. As her husband awaits his potential release, she says the support is helping him to get to that day. Yeah, I guess he's overwhelmed um, kind of with, you know, the amount of support that he's getting. He's in a good way. Um, he's just kind of like, wow. And I did reach out to the state to get their uh, response to this, and the DOJ says they cannot comment on a pending case. Angela? Yeah, it's getting a lot of attention, a lot of national attention as well, Russ. Good story.